Pick it up with Nebraska up 20 to 17. Todd Ellis, though, gets it to Harold Green. He cuts back and is in the end zone. It's 24 20, South Carolina late in the game. But Nebraska came back with one minute and 26 seconds on the clock. Steve Taylor drops back. There's Todd Milliken in the end zone, 11 yards, and it's 27 24, Nebraska. You figure it's all over? Think again. Under 30 seconds left on the clock, the Gamecocks on the Nebraska 19. Ellis wants to pass. He does, but it's picked off by safety Brian Siebler. That put the Nebraska win at it 27 to 24, and Siebler said, you just got to be in the right spot. I just guessed right. I anticipated well and uh, got a great break on the ball and got in front of it and picked it off. And I think this was a, a real good game for our football team. I uh, certainly feel sorry for South Carolina because they, they played a tremendous ball game, and I think they've got an awfully good football team. that the two teams have ever met. This is what it took for Nebraska to win. Steve Taylor hitting Todd Milliken with an 11-yard pass very late in the fourth quarter. That gave Nebraska the opportunity to go on top 27-24. to Moments later, South Carolina had driven deep into Nebraska territory when Brian Siebler pulled off this interception against Todd Ellis. 